Okay, so the first thing that is very, very important to do when you are, you know, getting ready and making sure that you look good is to actually moisturize your face. Think about it. That's the first thing that people see when they look at you. And um, it's just crazy how some people don't actually moisturize their faces. It really doesn't matter whether you have oily skin, dry skin, you need to moisturize your face. Give your face some TLC. And um, to start off with, um, I use um, a Vaseline Blue Seal. I love the cocoa butter one. Um, but you don't have to use everything that I'm using. You need to develop your own um, technique, your own skill, your own skincare routine. Find out what your skin loves and do that and keep on doing that. But what is very, very important is to make sure that you have and keep to a skincare routine. Take care of that skin. Now the next thing that I go in with is my Pond's Perfect Color Complex Anti Marks um, Serum for dry skin. This is a face cream for dry skin. My skin is a bit on a dry side, so I prefer this because um, the formula is not as drying as the one for oily skin. Last but definitely not least, I go in with my sun protection. SPF is very, very, very important. I cannot stress this. It's very important no matter what you use, no matter what um, routine you go for, no matter what products you use, you need to make sure that you complete the whole thing with your sun protection. You need to complete it with your SPF to protect your skin. And if you didn't know, actually, this is a nice thing about using sun protection. It helps lock in your moisture. Like, have you actually used your moisturizer and realized that during the day you tend to get a little bit dry? Well, if you use SPF, it locks in that moisture for a lot longer. So definitely try sunscreen and let me know how it goes. But I can promise you it will definitely help your moisturizer last longer and while protecting you from the harmful rays of the sun. We're all glowy, our skin is happy, the skin is loving it, it is glowy, you're looking gorgeous. Now the next thing you need to do is keep your eyebrows in check. You need to keep those eyebrows in shape, okay? Um, during the day, sometimes your eyebrows can get scruffy, get messy, and also some people just don't brush their eyebrows, and that makes such a huge difference. So you need to take your spoolie and actually um, brush those into place. Brush those into place. And a nice thing to do actually is to take an eyebrow gel or a glue, Definitely not super glue. Get your glue for your wig um, or for your edges. Um, if you use gel as well for your edges, you can try using that. Um, most people use got to be glued, and I actually also use got to be glued, um, spiking glue. Um, it has a strong hold, but it can definitely wash off. So definitely take something that you can wash out. Um, this glue or gel that you use is going to help to keep your eyebrows in place, in shape, and looking gorgeous the whole day so you definitely need to think of something like that and look at that difference look at that difference that it makes already there is nothing like mascara to wake those eyes up I'm using my Essence Lash Princess. She is tried and true. She gives a false lash effect. She gives you fuller lashes. What you want to go for is for length or you want to go for volume or both, but you want to do something that is going to give your eye that dramatic I'm awake effect. You don't have to be too dramatic with it because we don't have makeup. So you can just do a little bit and just see the difference. One of the biggest things that will actually help you look better is your hair looking better, looking presentable. So I'm going to style my hair right here in front of you um, so you can see how I do it. It is going to be the longer step of the other things, but trust me, it is worth putting your time into doing your hair. I'm first going to part my hair into sections as I would like to style it. And then I'm going to use my Isoplus Styling Gel.
When you have 4C hair, you have to be generous with every single hair product that you use all the time. You have to be generous. So be generous with the gel, um, let it in um, and just massage it into the hair because then it's going to make it easier for the sleek or for the hair to um, gel together and for the hairstyle to come out looking better. Once you're done massaging all that in, then go in with your brush and also repeat the process. Repeat until the hair is flattened out, until you're happy with the results. Repeat the process. I'm going to hold it together with a pantyhose. Then I'm going to get some baby hairs going. a little bit now it's time to go in with my Safeway hair straightener and straighten out and curl and basically style all these hair strands that I have standing up but so far this sleek looks nice I'm gonna wait for the hair straightener to heat up a bit and then I'm gonna get going so the bangs were giving excessive so I went ahead and parted them and reduced the size a bit so I'm going to have to patch this hair with the rest of the hair that I've already sleeped down and try and do a good job and then go all over again with the styling of the bangs okay
Now that we are done with our hair and our hair is looking cute, now it's time to take care of the lips. For lips, I'm first going to line it with my Essence Eyebrow Designer Pencil. Use that as lip liner, it's a brown one, perfect shade for me. And I'm just going to go over it with an effortless gloss, the Revlon Super Lustrous, the gloss in the shade Supernatural. And there you have it guys, five ways to look better without using makeup. These simple tips can be easily applied in your life and you'll definitely see a change in the appearance, in how you look and therefore how you feel and you know, you exhume confidence without even having to apply makeup. Let me know what you think about these tips down in the comment section below. If you aren't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button to join the fam and ring that notification bell to get notified every single time I upload a new video. Can't wait to see you guys in my next video.